Good morning, everyone. On behalf of the UBC team, welcome to the fifth annual Upstate Unleashed Conference. What a year we've had. A pandemic, election campaigns, stock market crashes and rebounds, historic unemployment, trillion dollar government programs, and nationwide protests for equity and inclusion. It feels like we have lived a decade in the space of 10 months. Speaking of a decade, when Martin and I started UBC in 2010, our vision was to help connect the region's founders to a network rich in resources where new connections could be made and pay it forward was the guiding principle. Today, entrepreneurs engaging with UBC can access a support network of over 15,000 people who are ready to help them succeed. One of the foundation stones for UBC's approach was Brad Feld's seminal book, Startup Communities. Nine years after his first visit to upstate New York, Brad is back with us to talk about the lessons captured in his new book, The Startup Community Way. 2020 was also the year when software ate up the world faster than ever. In the blink of an eye, the travel and hospitality industries were replaced by Zoom and Microsoft Teams. Telehealth visits shot up to levels that were not being predicted for another decade, and the internet became the lifeline through which people learned, stayed connected, informed, and entertained as schools, restaurants, cinemas, and playdates disappeared. The CEOs of Ursa Space and Post Process will share with us how this year became their moment to transform crisis into opportunity. Where do we go from here? That's a question we're all asking at multiple levels. Our friends John and Jeremy Zogby will share their perspectives on the recent elections and how Americans view rapid technological advancement. 2020 has also been a year of tremendous social upheaval. At UVC, we believe the pathway to technology entrepreneurship should be available to all, since it is one of the few paths to creating generational wealth in our times. Rodney Sampson founded Opportunity Hub with the goal of building a platform to support that mission. And he's already starting to engage with partners in upstate New York. Today, Rodney will share his views with Alicia Dix, the CEO of the Community Foundation of Oneida and Herkimer, in between today's sessions, you will also see and hear from the next generation of upstate entrepreneurs and their views on how we can build a more inclusive and growth oriented economy. It is the efforts of these founders that make us optimistic about upstates and our nation's future. UVC success would not be possible without a large group of believers who are putting their shoulders to the wheel every day to help emerging entrepreneurs and we want to thank every one of you. As a nonprofit that relies on corporate sponsorships and tax deductible donations, this year has proved to be a tough one to navigate. We are so grateful to our sponsors who stepped up to support us even as their own organizations were tightening their belts. For those of you in the audience, please consider adding UBC to your year-end giving and make a contribution via our website. The page you're looking for is ubc.org slash donate. If there's one team member at UBC who deserves the credit for creating this conference from concept to execution, it is Catherine Cartini. She has been an incredible resource bringing together her knowledge of television production, online marketing, and social media to make this our most impactful event ever. And with that, we invite you to enjoy the show. 